Hello everyone, welcome to Orchid Sea Learning. Today, let us see the objectives, question answers and exercises on the lesson Weather and Climate from Class 5 Social Studies. This is the most requested video of the week. So let us begin. First question, choose the correct options. Number 1. Our way of life is influenced by dash. Look at the options. A. Air B. Humidity C. Climate and D. Winds Our way of life is influenced by dash. And the answer is C. Climate Next, places near the equator receive the dash rays of the sun. Slanting, dim, morning and direct. Think about your answer. You can write the answers in comment sections as well as in your notebook for the better practice. And the answer is D. Direct. Next, rains have their source in dash. A. Winds B. Snow C. Hell and D. None of this. What is the source of rain? Answer A. Winds Number 4 Places near the sea coast get dash rain. Look at the options A. Less B. More C. No and D. None of these. And the answer is B. More. Next, places that are very cold experience dash. A. Waterfall B. Hell C. Snowfall and D. Rainfall Answer C. Snowfall The atmospheric condition at a given place and time is called dash. Option A. Weather B. Altitude C. Climate and D. Winds The atmospheric condition at a given place and time is called dash. And the answer is A. Weather Next question. Fill in the blanks. Number 1. The world is divided into dash major climatic regions. Three. The dash zone lies on both sides of the equator and touches both tropics. Torrid zone. The dash zone has extremely cold climate. Frigid zone. Fourth, winds have great effect on the dash of a place. Climate. Changes in the weather happens because of changes in the dash. Atmosphere Dash is the usual weather a place has over a very long period of time. Climate Dash has an effect on both weather and climate.
latitude. Next, write whether the following statements are true or false. Number 1. The weather can change from day to day. True. Climate can also change from day to day. False. People build houses with sloping roofs in Ladakh. False. The direction of winds at a particular time of the year affects climate. True. Next question. Match the following. Look at the options in column A. Latitude, Altitude, Pleasant and Humid. Column B. Nice. B. A lot of water vapor in the air. Parallel to the equator. Height of a place above the sea level. Think about your answer. You can write the answer as I told you in the comment section or else you can take your notebook or rough book and write it. Look at the answers. Latitude parallel to the equator. Altitude height of a place above the sea level. Pleasant means nice. And humid a lot of water vapor in the air. Question and answers. First, define humidity. When air has a large content of moisture or water vapor in it, it leads to humidity. I repeat the answer. When air has a large content of moisture or water vapor in it, it leads to humidity. Next question. Differentiate between weather and climate. The changes in the atmosphere over a short time is called weather of a place. Whereas the regular pattern of a weather that a place has over a long time is called its climate. Third one, how does rain occur? Winds that blow over oceans and seas carry moisture. These moist winds rise up and cool to form water droplets that fall down as rain. Sixth question, answer the following questions. These are little bit long question type, answer type questions. First one, name the five important factors that determine the climate of a place. The five important factors that determine the climate of a place are as follows. First, latitude or distance from the equator, altitude or height above the sea level, distance from the sea, humidity and direction of winds. How does A. Latitude and B. Altitude affect the climate of a place. You need to write how does latitude and altitude affect the climate of a place. First, latitude. The latitude of zero degree get most direct sun, direct rays of sun. The latitude of a place tells us how close or far it is from the equator. 
the nearer a place to the equator the hotter or warmer it will be as we move away from the equator the places get cooler altitude places at higher altitude receives lesser heat than those places that are at lower altitude hence the temperature at higher altitude are lower than the plains the temperature decreases as the height of the land increases how do winds affect the climate of a place winds have great effect on the climate of a place depending from where the winds originate they may be cool hot dry or full of moisture winds blowing from desert areas are hot and dry while those blowing from the sea are cool and moist how does the climate of a place affect the people living there climate affects our ways of life our clothing housing transportation and the food that we eat are all influenced by the climate of the place we live in for example ladakh in north india has a cold climate so houses here are built to get a lot of sunlight it has flat roofs and kerala in south india has a wet climate so here Houses have sloping roofs so that rain water can flow away easily. Next question, higher order thinking skills, hots. For each condition, you need to give an example. Okay? First one is altitude. Darjeeling is cooler than Delhi. distance from the sea example is delhi is inland far away from the sea while mumbai is near the sea latitude example jakarta is very close to the equator than new york New York is very far away from the equator. And direction of winds. Delhi is hot in summer due to dry and hot winds blowing from Rajasthan, while in winter cold wind blew from the Himalayas cause a cold wave in northern India. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to watch the lesson explanation of the lesson weather and climate please see the link given in the description box thank you thank you for watching please like and subscribe my channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated your comments and suggestions are valuable to us